So having a chair nearby and a flat block at the front of the mat. You're going to inhale and take the arms out and up. Stretch and look up. As you exhale, you're going to swan dive about halfway. You'll want to soften the knees, soften the spine. Then inhale and halfway lift with the hands up the top of the shins. Exhale, soften again. Inhale, step the right foot back. And as you exhale, drop the knee down. As you inhale, pressing on the left foot, rise the arms up to the sky. And as you exhale, bring the hands back down. As you inhale, keeping the right hand down, lift the left arm up and twist. And as you exhale, bring the hands back to frame the foot. Inhaling, lifting the back knee. Exhaling to plank. And then inhale here. And as you exhale, lower yourself down very slowly and stretch out both legs behind you. Slide the forearms forward and lift up the shoulders over the top of the elbows and come to a sphinx pose so that legs are as wide as you need them to be. You're trying to press the forearms down into the floor energetically. Open up the collarbones, send the shoulders back. Slide the shoulder blades down the spine. And it's almost like the bottom point of the shoulder blades is pressing forwards and up into your ribs. Come down now, forehead on the floor, hands under the shoulders, tuck toes and come onto hands and knees. And exhaling, take the down dog once again. Take a few deep breaths. Come up onto tiptoes, inhale, the right leg sweeps up. Exhale, right foot comes forward. Lift the back heel, pressing on the front foot, rise up to high lunge. If you keep the front heel lifted, it'll help. As you inhale, you're gonna lower the knee, the back knee, bend the back knee, and as you exhale, straighten the back leg. And you can do this with your arms up in the air, your hands in prayer pose, or your hands on the hips. Very intense. As you exhale, take your hands down and step the back foot forward. Inhale as you halfway lift and exhale as you soften the knees, soften the spine. Inhale, take the arms out, lift yourself up. And as you exhale, bring the hands into prayer pose. Then inhale, you're going to come up again, sweep the arms wide. Exhale, reach the arms out and soften down into a forward bend. Inhale, halfway lift, straight lines of the body. Exhale, fold. Inhale now, the left leg comes back and as you exhale, drop the knee. As you inhale, press on the front foot and raise the, right, the arms up. As you exhale, bring the hands gently down. Keep the left hand down and as you inhale now, open up to the right, taking the right hand to the sky. Exhale, hands to the floor, frame the foot. Inhale, lift the back knee. Exhale to plank. Inhale. And then exhale as slowly as you can, lowering to the floor, stretching out one leg at a time, allowing the legs to be apart. Come on up into cobra, pressing the hands down and forward into the mat. Be squeezing the elbows and shoulder blades towards you, lifting the throat back. Holding the pose and then releasing and bringing the forehead to the floor, tucking the toes under. Inhale, come to hands and knees. Exhale into downward facing dog. Taking some deep breaths. Come up onto the tiptoes. Press the heels down again. Raise the left leg up. Inhaling. Exhale. Bring that left foot between the hands. Right heel is lifted as you come up to high lunge. And you're gonna inhale as you lower the knee, bend the knee, and you're gonna exhale as you press the leg straight. You can do this with your hands in prayer, hands on hips. Lowering, bending the knee. As you inhale, and stretching the leg straight as you exhale. And now bring the arms forward, bring the back foot forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. And just soften here. 
Inhale, raise the chest up, bring the spine up straight. Exhale, hands come to prayer position. Inhale, we go again, arms out and up. Exhale, swan dive down, softening the knees as much as you need to. Inhale, halfway lift, draw the shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, slide the hands down. Inhale, right foot steps back. Keep the knee lifted, keep the heel lifted. And when you're ready, rise up to high lunge. Then bring the left hand on the lower back, the right hand to the heart and twist the torso to the left. Come back to center, inhale and take the arms up. As you exhale, reach the arms forward to the floor, frame that left foot, then come to plank pose. Exhale as you lower the body to the floor and stretch out one leg at a time. Send the arms back now and raise the arms, the legs, the chest and the throat off the floor in full locust. Squeezing the shoulder blades towards each other, squeezing the hands towards the feet. Bring the forehead to the floor, the hands under the shoulders, tuck toes, inhale coming onto hands and knees. Exhale, down dog. So you can adjust the position of the feet and the hands in down dog so that you really feel like your weight is evenly distributed between the hands and the feet. You're gonna turn your left heel in. And as you inhale, send your right foot between your hands, keeping the hips forward. Come up to warrior one. You can move your right foot out to the right a little bit for more balance. Come up and then step forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. You're going to come up, sweeping the arms out, lifting the chest, pressing on the feet. And exhale, hands come to the chest. Once again, inhale, stretch and lift. Exhale, swan dive down to the floor. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, left foot sweeps back. Keep the heel lifted. When you're ready, pressing on the front foot, come up into a high lunge. Again, you can do this with your hands in prayer, hands on the hips. You're gonna take your right hand now to your lower back, your left hand to your heart, and twist very, very slightly towards the right. Very gentle twist. Back heel is still lifted. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Exhale, reach the arms forward, frame the foot. Come back into plank and slowly lower yourself down. Now you can do any of these back bends again. You could do Sphinx, Cobra, Locust, or you can move from Locust into Bow, bending the knees, taking hold of the feet, lifting the feet and hands up, squeezing the shoulder blades together, opening up the whole of the front of the body. And then releasing, forehead to the floor, hands under the shoulders, tucking the toes, inhale under hands and knees, you can drag the hands back a little bit, exhaling to down dog. Release any tension from the neck. And you're gonna move your right foot forward and the heel down and move your left foot all the way to the front of the mat and come up, rise up for warrior one. Hips are facing forward and you can have the hands on prayer, hands on hips or hands up. And then you're gonna reach the hands forward and step the feet to the front of the mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. And as you inhale, Rise up, take the arms all the way up to the sky. Exhaling, hands come through third eye to heart. And we're going again. Inhale, stretch up. Exhale, swan dive and soften. Inhale, blossom dive where lift. Exhale, rest and fold. Now send both legs back into plank. Slowly lower to the floor. Inhale into Cobra, exhale into Downward Dog. Lower the knees to the floor. 
lower the bottom to the heels. Forehead to the floor and very gently come to sit on the heels.